Hey, let me show you in this tutorial how to import XML files, which are color schemes. Normally in PowerPoint, when you go to design, here on the right side, you have colors. You can either create your own color sets or use the predefined color sets. You can customize them by creating custom colors. If you, for example, bought a template or downloaded color schemes, ready color schemes from the web, like I have here, theme files, XML colors, we import them by copying them over to our PowerPoint system folder. Where is this folder? You need to open your PC. Why are those drives getting full so quickly? You need to go to your C drive, users, your user, and you need to open app data. If you don't see app data, please go to view, options, and in the viewing options, simply select show hidden files, folders, and drives. When you have the hidden folders shown, you go to app data, roaming, you search for Microsoft, and we are nearly there. In the Microsoft, we have a folder called templates. You click on templates and on document themes. And here we have our themes, our font sets and our colors. As I double click, you see we have those two custom colors which I had previously. Let me select the mm, XML colors that I have uh, with my template. And right now they should be available within PowerPoint. As I click on colors, you can see custom. Those are the basic office ones and those are the custom colors. Colors is very useful to have because we can very quickly change our presentation with one click. We can even right click, select edit and edit how this color looks. For example, if you want another color for the background, let's say I want a pink background, save. With this crazy color scheme, I could have this, always this purple background, this uh, pinkish background with one mouse click away. This is how you import those XML files into PowerPoint. You can, of course, the same way, go into this folder and simply press on delete, delete them, and my PowerPoint will be free of those color schemes. I hope this helps you to import XML files into your PowerPoint.